My name is Rory Blake. I'm a clinical pharmacist working with the microbiome. But I found a family of wild fishes that blows Darwin out of the water. All the fish in this tank are siblings, and they're all the same age. They began life as standard offspring of Cherokodone Audix parents in December of 2019. They're genetically identical, except that some of them started life with a substitute microbiome. These live-bearing fish are of the family Goodyads. Goodyads are very adaptable and live in small springs, streams, and even roadside ditches. Most are critically endangered and Cherokodone is thought to be extinct in the wild. It's hard to process the long odds against the survival of these small fish. Upon the birth of these fish, I transferred half of them to a smaller tank that another Goodyad species had lately occupied. I just transferred those fish to a larger tank. Generally, I keep all species in separate water supplies. However, since these were so endangered, I couldn't risk larger fish snacking up all of the newborn fry. Uh, my plan was to return them to the home tank after a few weeks when they were bigger. These fish were already way bigger than their siblings by then. Goodyads are known for their ability to adapt differently to different conditions, even those just a few hundred yards away. They can be full carnivores, full herbivores, or even omnivores. Specialized feeding characteristics such as a wide mouth or a narrow mouth have been known to come from the same mother. These fish, though, these bigger ones, are a completely new species. And this shows that the microbiome does more than just help something to digest food. It helps build a species. My blog, microbolics.com, has more. In conclusion, Darwin is wrong because it would take too long. There's no way that an organism can fit into a new niche using Darwin's principles. The microbiome is completely unappreciated. Bacteria working together make proteins and peptides and precursors and chemical intermediates for molecules that the body uses to make itself into a new species. Evolution comes from within. Thank you. And I do read my comments.